The youth of Hoima will be looking at over 3,000 jobs created when work starts on the Hoima Stadium. Bush clearing at the site has started with heavy work expected to start next week as construction expected to last 18 months kicks off. Everybody now uh, thinks that at least they will get something to, to do. To, they will get some opportunity here to work. Though it may not employ everybody, but I'm sure at least a number of, a number of people, a number of youth will get opportunities to get some employment as, as the construction goes on. The economy of Hoima will definitely see a shift in income as suppliers will look to take advantage of the huge number of people working there and the service sector will realize an economic boost. This uh, uh, development here is going to completely change Hoima City, the face of Hoima City. Uh, the business community is going to benefit. People who own hotels, people who own uh, restaurants. Already you can see the excitement around uh, so, what uh, we expect more when the, this stadium is completed. The youths have been advised to be on the lookout for fraudsters who are looking to manipulate the situation to fleece them. When there is development, you know, there are some people who are now using it to, to con people. Because, uh, like two weeks back, some person came from Kampala and started registering a number of youth around this area claiming that he's taking them to Kampala for training uh, so that there will be the, the, the security guards around the, the, the stadium. The deputy mayor of Hoima has called on residents to accord the contractors and workers all the help they require so they can beat the deadline. The construction is going to take only 18 months. And this contractor assured us that they are going to be working day and night to see that in 18 months delivers uh, the work. So please, the community around, avail them cooperation, uh, work together to see that uh, the partners, uh, to see that uh, the work is delivered in 18 uh, months. Uganda will host her first major soccer tournament in 2027 and works are already going well. The Mandela National Stadium has seen completion of Phase 1 and the UPDF Engineering Brigade has embarked on Phase 2 to ensure 2027 finds the stadium ready. Thank <laughs> you.